Hi Virgo. So I'm focusing this reading on the month of August for you. And uh, what are the energies that will highlight most of your month? And I got the Eight of Swords. Um, this is this is a card that's all about your mind, you know, the things you're thinking about. Uh, this is also a card that can deal with you can either not be sure or certain about, you know, just the future and what's going on. Uh, some Virgos this month can feel like uh, they're dealing with some type of anxiety, worry, right? Because you're not sure if you are able to really see everything that's in front of you clear so there could be some some victimization this month but i would not say like i feel bad for myself more so like i have a lot of things on my mind that i would really like to let go of because they they cause me to to stumble and to overthink and it doesn't really get me to do anything it just keeps me trapped you know so <clears throat> that could be an energy that you are going to be working with this month of how do i how do i get myself out of situations that i feel trapped or how do i find solutions to those situations where i feel like i am imprisoned or maybe i put up some type of mental wall up it can also be you are in a situation where you have no control over you know i see that there will be a new moon in your 12th house on the fourth of this month so maybe some rest will also be very needed for you because the sun is in the sign right before yours so it's like you need rest you know um maybe some time away from outside and just some time alone that might be good for you every now and then you'll be having a full moon on the 19th and that full moon is going to be happening in your sixth house which is the house you rule right so Maybe some of this anxiety can be coming from uh, your routines, your day-to-day, -day, your work, um, and the little things you do to take care of yourself, you know, just your habits. Uh, this is the Eight of Swords, so even the way that maybe you're making money, uh, that can also be something you're looking at this month, and how to get yourself unstuck, Okay. How to get yourself out of the binds that your mental binds so it's not like physically you have issues going on it's more like in your mind so that's what i see for you this month virgo